Hello everyone, my name is Nikki Stars, and welcome back to Undertale. Now we just dropped some water, we just gave Undyne some water after fighting her, and whew, boy, that was a hell of a battle. We got literally no, oh crap, clicking the wrong buttons. Why are, my Z button is broken. Do I not have any items? Hmm. A mysterious science house. The sign out says it's lab. Lab? Like, laboratory? Laboratory. Labator. Why? Does that mean there's a... Oh, God. Labrador. Why? Does that mean there are dogs inside? I mean, I wouldn't rule it out. Oh, God. Oh, there's a river dude. Tra la la, I am the river man. Or am I the rumor woman? It doesn't really matter. I love you to ri I would love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Riding the boat? Yes. Where will we go today? We can go to Snowden in the waterfall. So a Snowden, we could visit papyrus. Then we're off. This is a nice, nice transportation point. Hum, 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 hum. I'm having a little concert. That was a nice melody, bro. Oh, is this what this was? Come again sometime, tra la la. Sweet. Oh, I never went up. Did I go up here? Don't think so. Frick is that. You like to wander, you must be young. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. You like to wander, don't you, young one? The hell are you at that wolf? Alright, just throw you throw them blocks of ice that mysteriously combust out of there. Ah, my patience rewards me. I never, like, went into some place by myself, did I? Alright. I'm guessing Papyrus is not home. Why am I walking this way? Oh, I probably can go pick up some items. I mean, I'm pretty sure I've got some gold to spare, don't I? I hope so. The sight of a friendly town shows your determination. Use the box. Yeah, I literally have no items. I have the stick. Okay. I still have the dog wizard. Oh crap, I forgot to do that. Bye now, come again sometime. I wish this had a sprint button, but it doesn't. Tra la la, careful ride. His boat changed to ride the boat. Yeah. Where do we go? We're going back to the hot lands. And then we're off. Oh. Well, that boat changed. Tra la la, Tammy Village. The room before the darkening lantern room. Oh, so he could have given me a hint. Well, I already found it, so. Ha! <laughs> Come. 
Come again sometime, tra la la. Thanks, dude. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. Sorry, Undyne, like, told us that we're us totally a human was in the era, so, like, us royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Yeah, even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. Alrighty. Let's go in the lab, see what's in here. I am under surveillance. It's you. Good. It's too dark to see near the walls. It's too dark to see near the walls. Nope, just nothing. Oh. The hell is that? Oh. Don't kill me. Oh, my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. Go away, message. I have barely, sh I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's a mess, all messy, and. Um. Ha ha ha. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. B but uh I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've um been observing your journey through my council. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on the screen really makes you root for them. So, uh I want to, I know I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just one tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Or, or originally, I built him an entertainment, uh, an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like robotic TV star or something. Well, recently, I decided to make him more useful. You know, just someone, some small practical adjustments, like um, anti-human combat features. Uh, of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teeny teeny mistake while doing so, and um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with the first for human blood. <laughs> You're freaking retarded. Stupid. Sorry. No, that words. <laughs> but um, hopefully we won't run into him. Burst throughout the wall. Oh. Mm. Did you hear something? We're like jumping. Um. Oh no. What happened? Oh yes. Welcome, beauties. Oh, he actually came bursting throughout the wall. Today, to today's quiz show. Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. Yay. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die. Oh, it's a fight. Uh, check, Metaton. Attack 30, defense 215. 
his metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Let's start with an easy one. What is the prize for answering correctly? She's giving me a D. <laughs> right. Bleh, I didn't read that. Scream is screaming is not too much. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Asgore Dreamer. Admit <laughs> Doctor Friendship. The quiz continues. <laughs> Enough about me, you. Let's talk about me. What are robots made out of? Too easy for you, huh? Quiz continues. Here's another easy one for you. I don't know. There we go. Wonderful. I'm astounded, folks. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? Correct. You, you're so lucky today. Let's play a game of memory. Must have just frog yet. Oh, wait a minute. No, it's. I'm so flattered you remember. That's a frog it. You dingle. Would you smooch a ghost? Great answer. I love it. Why they were all heck yeah? I would. I, maybe if it was meta or uh, not metaton. Oh, bink. Of course, that was too easy for me. Time to break out the big guns. Listen, that's favorite, and she's the only one who wants it. And it's one of my favorite parts of the beginning because it's actually a powerful message about friendship and. <laughs> Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You weren't helping our contestant, are you? Ooh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphys have a crush on? Uh... I'm not. See, Alphys, I told you it was obvious. I was dicking around. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrawls her name on the margin of her notes. She names program variables after her. She even writes stories of them together, sharing a domestic life. Probability of crush, 101%. Margin of error, 1%. T it's, it's mixed with 100%, anyways. With Dr. Alphys' helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, with just a pilot. This was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama. More romance. More bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Uh, wait a minute. Metaton, you look like the machine that was from the first, or one of the puzzles from Papyrus's puzzles. Well, that was certainly something. Nothing? Okay, I'm just gonna raid your fridge. Wait, wait. Let me get you my phone number. Then, maybe, if you need help, I could... Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second, please. She's like destroying my phone. Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting items and it got a keychain. I even signed it up for the new Underground's number one social media network. Now we're officially friends. Eh. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'm raiding your fridge. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda.
Take a bag, just noodles? Yes. You got the instant noodles. To fill this frig. Oh, I can't take another. It's a bag of dog food, it's half full. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. So you just trap Metaton in here. The other feet are tabbing behind the door. All these books are labeled human history. Uh, read one. Why the hell not? You look inside the book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a for fighting a beautiful alien princess. It doesn't strike you as very accurate. Who is this demon? Pink group drips from its strange machine. Looks like Alphys' work table. Seems dusty. There's a heart. And there's a phone. Oh. The wardrobe is full of dirty cloud cuts and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They were all unopened. An incredible invention. When it's not used, the bed can fold an extremely easily draw a box. It's a pro it's a promo. It's a promo poster of Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. We got smudged up. Her feet are gone. I got a dimension box. Ooh, I can store more shit. Ring, ring. A lab? My brother would love that. He loves science fiction, especially when it's real. <laughs> I love papyrus. Oh, we're outside of that. Alphys updated her status, just realized I didn't watch the human fight the human. Alphys or Undyne fight the human. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Oh, boy. Oh, God, what am I fighting? Vulcan strolls in. Vulcan. Zero defense, attack 25. Mistakenly believes it's lava can heal people. Thunder, helpful speed up. Oh god. Vulcan praises around the room. You give hope and a hug. It warms your heart and your whole body. Ouch, your fence drops. Ah, so lovey. Oh. Vulcan cheeks glow with the bright heat. You won. 40 gold. Hey, that's not bad. That's a pretty good. Gonna call them in a minute. Okay. Stop. Just call me then. We... Ooh, there's lava. With the, the whooshing sound of steam and cogs. It fills you with determination. Magma chip. Oh boy. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do that. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, LMAO. Oh, that's a whoosher whoosh. Tsundere Plin. Tsundere Plin gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. Tsundere Plin. Attack. 25, defense 26. Seems mean, but does it secretly like you? No way, why do I like you? God. Tsundere Plane shakes its nose domestically at you. I tell Tsundere Plane that has nice turbines. Huh, <laughs> you sicko. Sorry. That's what I thought planes were into. Sorry. Tsundere Plane, uh, approach. You get close to Cinderella Plane, but it's not, but not too close. Eh? Human? Oh. 
<laughs> oh, I got, I got, I got a home. Oh, it turned into a small plane. Where am I going? It is a frying pan over there. Give me the frying pan. I want the frying pan. There's a frying pan laying on the ground. Will you take it? You got the burnt frying pan. The burnt pan. Burnt pan, weapon 10. Damage is rather consistent. Consume of items here for more HP. Ooh, that'll be useful. But I like more invincibility. No, I like more invincibility. Oh my god, I have to claw over. I have to claw over my last. the last digit for five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Then do it. Ring, ring, click. Whoever's calling hung up before you answered. Uh, hi. So, the blue lasers. Uh, I mean, Alpha's here. Hi. The blue lasers don't hurt you if you don't move. Orange ones, um, you have to be moving. And they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Uh, bye. Click. Oh my god, I did it. Claws haven't shook like that since Undyne called me to ask her about the weather. <laughs> Wait a minute, there's no weather down here. Why did you call me? No. It's a switch, press it. Yeah. This is reactivated. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. Keep it me right now. It's a photo of the garbage can. With several pink glittery filters over it. Aw. Ring. Ow! This year. <laughs> the north door will stay locked until you solve puzzles on the right and left. I, I think you should go for it right first. No, I'm gonna go. I didn't want to go that way. Stop. Yeah, boy, I want to be left. Suck my left. Alpha's here. That blue laser seems totally impassable, but I'm at the Royal Scientist. I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the Hotland laser to database and take it out. Click. Are you related to Grillby? She's here pretty hot. Finally, someone turned that laser off. Now I can be free and, well, I guess we'll just... I guess we'll just keep standing here. We never hang out when suddenly a... We were hanging out when a bunch of suddenly a bunch of random puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. That's a huge problem. It's, it rules. I gotta... I, they gotta get to school for this. All right. Uh, oh, shit. Ha! I'm the best. I don't even need directions. Boink. Suck on my left and right nut. I wonder if they would, it would be in front if I explained the puzzle. Nope, I already had it. What the hell are you? The door leading through this area is closed, so I tried the puzzle. But I kept running out of ammo, and I kept restarting. The two co-workers won't help. It's just like they don't even want to get to work. Is there like a way... How did you keep running out of ammo? That was literally the simplest thing ever. Well, 
those doors open. Whatever, I'll just explain it. Uh, I think, um, hey, about the puzzles on the left and right. They're a bit difficult to explain, but, uh, you already solved them. Awesome. Click. Aw, oh, yeah. This is a bit of a peculiar platform. Hey, it's kinda dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry, I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Oh. I'm in a kitchen. Oh no. Oh yes. Welcome beauties to the Underground's premier cooking show. Cooking with the killer robot. Preheat your ovens because we got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. L my lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand. Yay, confetti. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. You found the eggs. Why is it so laggy? Okay, now it's done. Perfect. Great job, beautiful. We got all the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, what a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We are missing the most important ingredient. Oh, I pull out a penis. A human soul. Oh God, please don't. I'm gonna run towards it. Ring. Hello, I'm kinda in the middle of something here. W wait a second. C couldn't you make a. Couldn't you use a. Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean non human ingredient? <laughs> Why? W what if someone's vegan? Vegan. Well, I. Uh, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys. <laughs> Actually, I happen to have an option right here. MTG brand always convenient human soul flavor substitute. A can of which is just over on that counter. A very suspicious looking counter with no back. <laughs> well, darling, why don't you go get it? Still fiddling with that microwave, ain't I? Can't blame you for being totally unarmed with an electric box. I kinda wanted to just walk away from it. Oh god, it's gonna explode. Oh, uh, never mind, it's literally exploding upward. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get up there in the next one minute, We'll just have to go back to the old original plan. So, better start climbing, beautiful. Ring. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. Fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? Watch this. Whoa, dude. You broke my phone. How the hell do you put that in the phone? You should have no, just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there. Oh god. Uh, I gotta. Please don't hit me. I'm good at dodging.
Tater tots, freaking potatoes. Oh god, nope, 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 nope. Pataton, stop it! I made it! My, my, it seems you've bust bested me. But only because you had the help of brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I loathe to think of what you would happen to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen cooking shows before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. I was not even that high. Wow, we we did it. We we really did it. Great job out there, team. Well, uh Anyway, l let's keep heading forward. Click. So is my phone good? Can I call Papyrus? Did that, like, did all of that stuff heal me, or is that just because of, like, a thing in the fight? No response. Oh, God, what the hell is that? An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Core view. So that's the core, eh? Right. See that building in the distance? That's the core. The source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical energy by, uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. In the core, in the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there you can go home. Can I go back to, wait, wait. I kinda wanna go back because I just remembered Papyrus said something about hanging out with Undyne one time. Oh wait, that's right, I can't go back yet, oops. So that'll be next episode, I probably. Select the location. Uh, right two. There's something wrong with this elevator. Oh, what's up? <laughs> I'm Heat Flamesman. Heat's Flamesman. Remember my name. Hey, it's Sansy. Toasty Bun. I love hot dogs. Hey, isn't it weird there's snow on the guy's roof? Guess he's not. He guess he's too lazy to clean it off. Hey, buddy, what's up? Wanna buy a hot dog? It's only 30 G. You're holding too much. Guess I'll put it on your head. Here's another hot dog. It's, it's on the house. Well, no, it's on you. Hey, have fun. Hey, have fun. Oh God, we're just gonna keep going. Ah! Sorry, 30 is the limit on head dogs. Can I like... No, I'm gonna. I have the freaking uh, dimensional box B, so I'm just gonna put some things in there. I'm gonna put the burnt pan in there. I'm gonna put a bicycle, and I'm gonna put a cinnamon bun in there. Yeah, dog. Astroph dog. It's short for hot dog. Uh, I think I broke it. Sands, there's a floating, never mind. We.
dinner with the girlfriend. It's a picture of a cat girl figurine next to a bowl of instant noodles. Cool skeleton 95 posted on the picture. Are we po wait? I think it's papyrus because it's all caps. Are we posting hot pics? Here's me and my cool friend. It's a picture of papyrus flexing in front of a mirror wearing sun wearing sunglasses. Giant muscular biceps that are pasted onto his arms. The biceps are also wearing sunglasses. <laughs> papyrus. Power up bound toward you. Uh, attack 29, defense 14. The mischievous monster is never warm enough. Hot enough for you. It's pretending to pull the fire alarm. You crank up the thermostat, the pirate begins to be excited. Hot, hot, hotter, hotter. Pyro wants more heat. You crank up the thermostat, it's super hot, Pyro will satisfy. Hot, hotter, hotter, hotter. Oh, jeez. No, you bastard. Uh, I guess I saw that coming, but Jesus. He is a strong motherfucker. Oh, I have to start from the freaking elevator. Heats, flamesman. I'm not gonna buy a hot dog, Sans. Alphix posted. Skeleton. And Pyro. Oh god, what is that? No. No bomb. No bombs. That's not freaking cool. Thursday in 20, 40, 50, 45 or 15. What's this? Naps to block 22, send you a friend request. Accept a request? Accept. It seems to already rejected it itself. Aww. <laughs> There's an apron lying on the ground. Will you take it? You're carrying too much. Fine. He goes 1 HP every other turn. Oh, hell yeah. So then I'll have longer... I'll have longer, um... Invincibility, and I'll have healing, kinda. Uh, oh crap, what was he doing? Sorry. You'll have to press all three of them in three seconds. I'll try to help you, but you gotta get through them. God, Elvis, I will beat you. Hey, uh, looks like you need to press two of them. That, like, hurts. Like, that re legitimately hurts me. I can't. There. Now I feel better. Oh, God. Shut up, Elvis. Uh, hey, I'm going to the bathroom, so I'll be MIA for a bit. I, I, I'm sure you can handle this puzzle by yourself. So then if I go over here, if I go over to the right, it'll be forwards, and then if I hit that one, it'll be backwards, and then it'll be forwards again.
Bank. Bank. Bonk. No. Uh, I'm so confused. Can I, like, not step on that one? Yeah, I can not step on it. So if I click that, it's gonna go forward, and then if I click that, it's gonna go backward, and if I click that, it's gonna go forward. So if I got this... I didn't want to do that. All right, so if I go and hit the first one, it's going to go backwards. And then if I hit that one, it's going to go forwards, so it's going to be bank and bank. Stop. Because I need to go all the way around. That's there for a reason. Oh my god. This is freaking impossible. I didn't want to do that. Oh my god. So, if I go down, it's going to be forward, back, forward, back. Oh, that just undoes that. See, I don't know how to do this. Oh, you're pissing me off, game. I freaking hate you. Okay, so I'm, th I'm trying real I'm really trying to think about this. <laughs> Excuse me. I have no freaking clue. If I go to the top if I, okay, I'm gonna move my mouse for a minute. If I go here, and then I jump here, 
after, after I go down here, this is gonna switch these two to here. And then I land on this, this is gonna go up there. If I go up there, it's gonna just go away. If I go up there, it's just gonna switch these, reversing everything that I've done. And then I go down here, and then I use this. And then I go down here, and then down here, and then down here, and blah, 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 blah. I don't know. Let's try this. No, I'm freaking so close. That's how I want it. Set the puzzle there. So now if I go down, I go down this way. It's gonna go point down, down. Right, left, right. Okay, I got... Uh, no, I don't. Nope. So, right, left, right, left, right. But I want it like this. Right, left, right. And that's not gonna work. So now that I have it right, then it's gonna be left, right, left, right, left. Right. No, god damn it. No, I had it. Why did you have to dick me over? Left, right. Next one's left, right, left. Fuck. Because if I do this, then it switches that down, and then I hit that again, and it goes back up. I think I want that down. You know what? No, I'm going to freaking... I can't go to Undyne's house, can I? No, I freaking can't. I don't know, I'm just gonna try freaking everything.
so then right, left, right, left, right. Try to go back into Undyne's house because I can't freaking solve this bullshit. I'll do that when I have time because right now I just I can't do that. Oh, this is really goddamn two two bucks. That's legitimately pissing me off. Good night, your sands. I don't want to talk. This game is pissing me off already, and it's like near the ending, probably. Let's go to the left floor. Oh boy. Oh, hey, I can. Alright. Let's go to the waterfall. No, not the fucking snowed in! <laughs> Trolla, hmm, I should go kill myself. Clicked waterfall, didn't I? Thank God. Please tell me we're off the freaking tra la la. Suck my dick. Tra la la. You're such a prick. Tra la la. You're a little ass. Tra la la. You're kind of an ass. Oh, we never rolled the little ducky. You feel a calming tranquility here to the time. Oh god, it's almost been an hour. Jesus. This little bird wants to carry you. Oh shit. Oh, this bird's strong as hell. He's so cute. He's just resting in the water. Oh, I'm back here. Okay, I didn't want him back here. Little ducky. fish house. Oh, it's papyrus. Oh, -ho, the human arrives. Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you two great friends. Will you hang out? No. Hmm. Still getting ready. Take your time. Okay. All ready to up and to hang out? Will you hang out? Yeah, I'll hang out. Okay, stand behind me. Psst. Make sure to give her this. She loves my bone. <laughs> yeah, it is on time. Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one on one training? You bet I am. I brought a friend. Hi, I don't think we've. <laughs> uh. Why don't you two come in? I leave. 
You hear someone shouting a whisper at that inside your house. No, you can't escape friendship. Here, Undyne. My friend brought a gift for you on their own. Uh, thanks. I'll, uh, put it with the others. Damn. So many bones. So are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie, I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. You two have fun. Oh. Okay. So why are you here? To rub your victory in my face? To humiliate me even further? Is that it? Yes. <laughs> well, I've got news for you, brat. You're on my battlefield now, and you aren't going to humiliate me. I'll tell you what's going to happen. We're going to hang out. We're going to have a good time. We're going to become friends. You'll be, you'll be so enamored with me. You'll be, you'll be feeling humiliated for your actions. <laughs> it's a perfect revenge. Er, why don't you have a seat? Oh, leaving so soon? No, no you're not. Oh, leaving so soon? No, no you're not. I can't believe he leapt through the window like that. Normally, he nails the landing. One time, Alpha's uh, friend... Well, he did lie seductively on the piano and fed himself grapes. I don't really like that guy. But I admire his lifestyle. You want to see my room? Too bad. Nerd nerds allowed. Well, maybe some nerds. Alphys. Look inside the bone drawer. Oh god, the freaking dog. Inside the sink, there's a teacup in the shape of a fish. Oh, that's cute. The oven is a top of the line MTT thing. But, you know, as much technology advances, nothing beats food home cooked with fire magic. Like Toriel. There's a silverware drawer. There's forks, spoons, knives, tiny swords, axes, spears, nunchucks. I hate cold food. So Alphys fixed my fridge so it would heat food up instead. Hot fridge. The world's greatest invention. Humans suck. But their history kind of rules. Case in point, this giant sword. Historically, humans welded swords up to ten times their size. Right. When I first heard that, I immediately wanted So me and Alphys built the giant sword together. She figured out all the specs of herself. She's smart, huh? It's nice to have you over. Why not take a seat at the table? Sit at the freaking table, you little nerd. Happens if I get talking to you. Nothing? Okay. Sit down, progress. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. Oh. All set. What would you like? Oh, Jesus Christ. Hey, don't get up. You're the guest. Sit down and enjoy yourself. Um, <laughs> why not just point it what you want? You can use the spear. Oh, I can use. I can select undine. Sugar goes in tea. Soda, sticky yellow liquid. Hot cocoa, green cylinder. Green, that's blue. Tea box, blatantly correct choice. Good. <laughs> I would gladly give you full swords if you weren't my loved house guest. The fridge? You want to have the entire fridge? No. Then I'll just have you. Are you hitting on me? 
Mm -hmm. Nothing, okay. Oh, that's T. T? Huh, <laughs> coming right up. It did take a moment for the water to boil. That's that's how tea's made. Okay, it's all done. Oh, here we are. Be careful, it's hot. It's not that hot. Just drink it already. And take a sip of the tea. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best, absolutely precious friend. Hey. I know it's kind of strange that you chose that tea. Golden flower tea. It's Adgor's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenies. Sort of. You know, I was pretty hot at kid. Once, I, to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time, he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me? Do you want... You know how to beat me. I said yes, and from then on he trained me. I felt bad, but he was beaming. I'd never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story. I'm one who gets to train dorks to fight, like, uh, Papyrus. But, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can let Papyrus with the Royal Power. Don't tell him that I said that. He's just, well... I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's... He's too innocent and nice. I mean, look. He was supposed to capture you, and he ended up being friends with you instead. I could never send him into battle. He'd get ripped to shine like some little smiling shreds. It's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know? So, um, maybe he can do something else with his life. Oh, sorry, I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Uh, wait a second, Papyrus. His cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now. And if he's not here to have it, then you'll have to have it for him. That's not how that works. Oh. That's it's not good. That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking, which means if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine. <laughs> Afraid? We're gonna be the best friends. Ow, oh, my hair. It's not good. Let's start with the sauce. We're making spaghetti. Oh boy. Envision these vegetables are your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. I'll be a pound. Strong! You punch the vegetables in full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah! Yeah! Our hearts are uniting against the, the, these healthy ingredients. Now it's my turn. Yeah! Oh. Kinda got some sauce over there. Uh, we'll just scrape that in the bowl here. But 
for now. We need to add noodles. Homie noodles are best. But I but I just buy a store brand. They're the cheapest. Yeah. I just put them in the pot. I can put them in. Fiercely. You throw everything in the pot as hard as you can, including the box. It clanks against the empty bo bottle. Yeah, I'm into it. All right, now it's time to stir the pasta. A general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Uh, stir harder. I'm trying harder. harder. I'm trying. Uh, let me do it. Oh, jeez. Oh, that poor spoon. Oh, that poor pot. <laughs> That's the stuff. All right, now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let the stove have symbolize your passion. So that your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? Don't hold anything back. Left, you fool. The burner only goes one way, hotter. Hotter? Darn it. Uh, your house is gonna explode. Uh, let me do it. See, that's how you... We're dead. We burned. We died. Uh, man. No wonder Papaya sucks at cooking. So what happens next? Scrapbook? Fishing? Friendship bracelets? Oh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to, to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel the same way. And if we can't be friends, then that's okay. Because if we're not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret. Oh. I've been defeated. My house is shambles. Even, I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All, bo all out on both sides. There's only one way I can regain my lost pride. Come on, hit me with all you've got. Undyne is letting you make the first attack. You pretend to swing it, Undyne is, with all your might. What? That was the best you could manage? Even attacking a full force? You can't muster to intend to hurt me, huh? <laughs> you know what? Oh. I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated your stupid charade and stick, but the way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you're just some wimp, not just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human, it seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight. But knowing him, he'll prob he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fell, fell down here, and I'll take their stole instead. That makes sense, right? <laughs> oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, and I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the hell out of you. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> now let's get the hell out of this flaming house. Oh, you're also crying. Well, that was fun, huh? We have to hang out again some, another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I have to go hang with the pies. So, if you drop, need me, drop ice note, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give the pies a ring, okay? Since we're in the same spot. I'll be able to talk to you. Well, see you later. Well, and that marks the end of the episode. Okay, so, yeah, that's the end of that. I knew I was missing something. Mouse go down there. But, yeah, it just struck me like, oh, Papyrus wanted me to meet with Undyne, and that just looked like a fish house. I Undyne's a fish. So, yeah, put two and two together. But, anyway, that's all the time I forgot for this episode. Uh, that puzzle. I will do that along after I do with Temi Village, because I'm not doing that for like another half an hour. Pretty sure I did that for like 20 minutes. 10, 20 minutes, I don't know. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you